Hey Breezers, how are you guys? Foodie Beauty is live right now. It is titled Let Snack Bees. She just said she's stressed out, so she's stress eating. And then she started talking about why she's moving to Montreal. So let's go ahead and watch this together. Um, the diversity, mindset diversity. There's a gay village. Um, rent is cheaper. There's a lot more studios. It's closer to Nader and big. Didi. All inclusive, just little cute little queen apartments. Chicken pick, pickle, welcome very important. Beezers ready, said bees. Fuck, you know, so I've just been liking Montreal. Mm -hmm. A lot of men I'm interested in live there too. Yeah, I know. One in particular. Toronto's very expensive. So what are you stressed out about? Montreal's cheap. Let's see. Oh, Melissa, Faye said, it looks like you're chasing Nader and Didi. I'd never move near my ex if I had a choice. Same. Oh, and then Plain Cheeseburger just said, wait, what? You're moving to Montreal? Yeah, she supposedly is. I speak French. I'm not going to leave him high and dry. <laughs> the way she said that was weird. <laughs> yes, Montreal is beautiful, but the food, holy fuck, yes. Orange Jula? There's a huge diversity of food, culture. So you just want to be closer to the orange julep? I don't know. a lot of reasons why I wanted to move to the city I moved to and I never once thought like so I could be closer to a fast food place not once not once I was hoping to get my own place mm -hmm. yeah plain cheeseburger with Pete's see what's going on in this chat i think i mean someone asked when do you want to move i'm not chasing him hmm. i swear this has nothing to do with him at all uh-huh i'm seeing a couple of men from there but there's a lot more to do there I want, I think Pete will be happy being near a gay village. Yeah, but since when do you care about what's good for Pete? I'm not trying to be mean. Well, maybe a little bit, but I'm just saying, like, since when do you care? Your motives just, I don't know. It seems like you have, you have a motive. I don't know, so far. Let's see. Lena said, we trust you. We do? We all know the consequences of him being in your life, let alone you seeing him. You're not dumb. You are smart. You're being very generous with that comment. I, haven't, I don't really have a date. Like, I don't want to go to the States. No. Mm-mm. Those were so good, this breeze. No way. I'm not going to fucking. Sorry, you guys, for the crunching in advance. Um, Black Zillion asked, What about Toronto, Windsor? That's all I got. On a dark desert highway, said, This is unhealthy for you. Oh, maybe thumbnail woohoo? It's very unhealthy. I would be worried moving closer to him. He won't know where I live. Booty beauty, you, you announce where you are all the time on your socials. 
If you're afraid of him, it doesn't make sense to move closer to him. It just doesn't. Me, he won't know where I live. He'll never know. He'll never know. No, you're never gonna get it. Uh uh uh. Mm. Hmm. What do you guys think? What's your opinion? Do you think I should move? Like, he won't. Not to Montreal. He won't even bother. I don't think he'll bother with me. He's with GD Maybe now. he won't, but you'll bother with him, and that's weird. And that's the problem. So, fuck. Okay, Tiffany said, I think the move would be good, but don't think there. But just take some time to think about it and do what you think is best. Oh, no, don't tell her to do what she thinks is best. Okay, let's go to real time. We're just a couple seconds oh, behind. Do you need pickles? In New York. Mm. Let's see. Jen said, um, it seems like seeing a therapist and getting on track to your other goals might be a good idea before starting the daunting task of moving. Agreed. Oh my gosh, thumbnail woohoo. Thumbnail woohoo. Okay, let's watch a little bit more together, you guys. Yeah, Gemini. You think it's asking for trouble? What do you mean by that? Okay, explain what you mean. It's a horrible idea to move closer to him. You can't stay away. You keep watching their live streams. Like, you won't be able to stay away. It would drive you crazy knowing that you live near him and you can't see him. It's just a bad idea. Sorry, you guys. The chat was stuck. Um, Let's see. Meg said, at the end of the day, it's up to you. Um, on our Dark Desert Highway said, you need to let go. All we've been doing for the last week is talking about them again. Yeah, like, I'm not trying to be close to him. I think you are. Um, let's see. Fupa Princess said, if Desert Highway, if Desert Highway gets yeah, blocked, man. I'm out. Might get blocked. Desert Highway. I don't want him. I don't. I just want to live somewhere else. There's plenty of other places to move to. A suburb in Ottawa sucks. Why there? Munching on taffy. Salt water. Hmm. Her energy is just so low. It's crazy. Vibes are definitely off. Keely said, I think that if you wanted to see him, you would. No matter how far or close you are. I don't think your location actually matters. That said, do whatever makes you happy and live your best life. So, I mean... So... You know what? Kiss my butt. <laughs> have you ever tried? Have you even tried to look anywhere else? Did you even look into any other cities? I mean, there's so many other options of places you can move to. Why there specifically? It just doesn't make sense to me. You know what I think he told Dee Dee? What? He must have lied to her. Okay. And said, oh no, with her, she's not my girlfriend. Over and over. So, like he did, you know, with her to me, whatever. Okay. Uh huh. But then he claimed her. He said, I'm. I heard her say, he probably told her that I'm his business partner. Business partner? What business? Oh my fucking god. Wow, biggest liar of life. Well, Ugh. 
All three of you are pretty big liars. I don't know if one's better than the other or bigger than the other. Y'all three lie. Do we have these now? Um, Gemini Gem said, I say go for it and change your lifestyle up. Have some fun. I don't, she's not going to have fun if she moves there, knowing she's, she could run into him at any time or knowing that she lives in the same city, but she can't see him. It's going to drive her crazy. Mm. Well, it says berries and chairs. I don't think so. Mm. Business partner. <laughs> Where is the business? What business? All right, all this noise. Okay, let's go to real time. We'll I watch know, for right? a few more minutes, you guys. <laughs> Desert Highway. There's one who does... I do all the blocking. Well, you know what? That's good. That's good to know, right? For people to know. Okay. Fupa Princess said she likes all the mods. All three of the mods. Good to know. Let's scroll up and see if we missed anything good in the chat. Well, Daddy said bring back I Vegas. Love salt. <laughs> is she? What is she doing? Jeez. Did she take an edible? Is that why we're eating cheese out of a can right into our mouth? Go to bed, foodie. It's spray cheese. <laughs> Go to bed. On a dark desert highway says, I'm sorry, but the easy cheese screams time for an intervention to me. <laughs> My food smelled like smoke and I heard yelling. Emerald Sky said you're going to be swelled up, Shanty, from all the sodium. Oh, my gosh. Uh, oh, my God, Sofa. Mm. Hi, sweetie. Where's Jimmy Hughes? Mm. All right, food. I think you need to go to sleep. Day. Yeah, sort of, Beezer. Why was the chef always coughing? All right, this crunching's becoming a lot. It's been a lot, but. Why is, why is there rage in my lobster bisque? Oh, I don't know. Thumbnail woohoo. Oops. Oh, you mother Hold sucker. On. Oh, there we go. <laughs> okay, she got a super chat. Please keep all the bullies blocked for creep sofa. It's not like he can't turn off the computer or block someone. Only unblock trolls, not the bullies. <laughs> all right, foodie, mm -hmm. I might have to check back in with you later when you're done crunching or something. Crunching and munching. Just wanna, Bazillion said, you are eating chips again, be back later. I hear ya, I totally understand too. What? Hi guys. Hello. Someone asked, was that curly? Juicy said, Sofa, don't even worry about them, King. What does that even mean? Oh, boy. Juicy said, probably Kermit or Alyssa. Emerald said, LOL, Amelia, I thought the same thing. Yeah, she needs to go to sleep. Just one of a zillion said she is. Oh, well, I can't read that, but that's what they said. Go on. Hi, BBJ. Hi, sweet girl. <sighs> oh, 
All right, you guys, we'll check in with her later. <laughs> I hope you guys are having a great day, a great evening, wherever you are, and I will see you so soon. Bye.